Yo, what's up, Tarnish? It's your ball being we back with hold on. We back with another video in today's video, bro. We're gonna be talking about my build. I know a lot of y'all been asking me what build am I running with lightning magic. So I'm gonna go ahead and tell all of y'all what I'm running. So before we even start, bro, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe, bro. Join the family. We're on the road to 19k subscribers. What are you waiting for, bro? Let's make it happen. But Without further ado, bros, let's get straight into the video. I would really love it if we do hit 19k before the end of this month. I thought we were gonna hit 20k by the end of this month, but a lot of things happened and we had to change the course of actions. But you know, we're still on the path, but we're just a little slower this time around. But let's get straight into it. Boom. So first and foremost, you know, we're gonna tell you exactly what we're running. We're running light magic, obviously, because this is a build for it. Um so light magic is the first DPS magic, so damage per second so every move on this grimoire is going to do jam damage per second so it's going to be it's going to do a lot of damage and this grimoire is not getting nerfed it is put in the game because of dr users dr users are damn near impossible to kill um now because of how much health they can have so it being the first dps magic and it could you know face off with a dr user and you know you're not getting one shotted with dr and plus you know the stuff that they're going to add in the future for dr a lot of magics might get a buff i'm not gonna lie to you so don't be don't 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 be you feel me tight that your magic's not doing enough damage and everybody feel like they gotta switch the light but yeah light is not getting a nerf light already drains majority of your mana so like even just using one move as you can see here bro it took like 300 just to use that move once there's no other magic first skill that does that you know what i'm saying so you can only use it a few couple of times and then we're running lunarian lunarian it gives um it has a this is the defense side you get 20 percent defense and then when you turn it off you get more damage more speed and but you take more damage and i think you get 50 percent more damage because i do an outrageous amount of damage because i remember doing 60 then i jumped up to 120 so i think it's 50 percent more damage and then i'm using you know the mystical eye the reason why i'm using mystical eyes because these have to you know these have to proc i'm going to show you why that mystical eyes is probably the best matchup especially with this magic because it does damage per second and you have to hit a certain amount of times for it to hit its crit so like bro it it procs very often so now watch this this is so when it hits the five that's when you hit a critical right so let's watch this look at that critical and he pushed me he bro he literally pushed me like bro if he didn't push me i would have hit a critical again look at that critical you see how many times i hit my critical like five seven times off of just one one attack bro you see what i'm saying so like mystical eyes really do work with this build um we're also you know we have our demon but we don't really use it we're still trying to level it up so we get it straight and i think that would be like the end of my build and i also do got to get a corrupted demon and change the stats so the stats actually work with my demon and i gotta raise the percentage because i'm only at 10 percent. so that's how you know what percent your demon is at it says it on top that you figure it out if you want souls you got to kill bosses by yourself and etc i already know and if you ever do want to feed your demon it's it takes you know body parts and look you see boom it shows up like this and then that's their xp board and then for armor, what we're running, I'll show you right now. Oh, stats. So with stats, these are armor stats, but I'm running um, the, Arcan um, the Arcanist build. So you have to have like at least 70% of your actual stats and intelligence, then you'll get this trait, which in removes the soft cap. Not not soft cap, it removes the hard cap on your um, magic. I don't know if, if y'all knew about that. I'm gonna make a stat video because I know a lot a lot of people don't know that you can remove the soft cap off certain things. But I'm gonna show I'm gonna have a whole video for that. So make sure y'all stay tuned for it. And I got y'all, bro. And then constitution, yes, there's a there's you can remove the soft cap off of constitution too. I know a lot of y'all be like, how you have six thousand health? How do you get that much health? I got you, bro. I got you. It's gonna be in another video though. Um and we're running 185 in con. And this majority is from the armor and like all the stuff that I have on. We're we're using the Clover Clover Guard, Lieutenant Helm, which is giving us 10 con. And then for shoulders, which is the Ether Stone Pauldrons, gives us 20 con. No. Modified Wolf Hunter. Oh, okay. These are just a modified thing. Okay, Wolf Hunter. 
bandolier we got five con damage reduction 10 you know for the chest so for waste we have nothing i don't think there's any like waste um items in the game yet for the ring i think we're just using like yeah Azur diamond chris which gives two intelligence you're gonna equip up to three of them and then for back we got the crimson majesty gives uh 25 intelligent fire resistance for neck we're using the fire um the lesser fire resistance amulet which you have um five con and then for earrings we're using the gorgon's earring which you give 15 dex and eight intelligence and then for armor we can you can use uh drake heart armor which would be better because you can you know reheal your mana and your health you can wish for more mana all this stuff but it does have a cooldown you can't just spam it um, and then, you know, it help with all that mana drain situation. But I think Monstrous Reserve would also be good with this. Because it gives you a percentage of mana. So, it's up to you if you want to use that. So, you can use more of your spells. But me, I want that extra crit. And I'm not even, I'm not even like, mad that I run out of mana. Because by the time you're done with, like, your first skill, bro. It's gonna, you, you're going to be done already, bro. Trust and then the Alpha Desert Claw Armor, which gives me 25 con, 15 dex, damage reduction 40, which helps with the, you know, you feel me, with the, you taking damage. So, like, the damage reduction is great on this armor. Like, it's, it's massive, bro. Like, 40% less damage. You know what I'm saying? You have damage reduction. It's almost 50, so it's really good. So, if you want to use a Lunarian race, so you don't take that much damage, regardless, you turn the flames off or on. Now, I don't know if Fab is going to, you know, end up nerfing this armor because of, you know, this loop around that I found. But if he does, then I'll change it to a different. I'll probably just use Drake Heart armor. But that's the only reason why I'm using this armor because of how much damage reduction you really do have. Um, damage increased by 10% also. You know what I'm saying? So, and that's on everything. And with that added, plus the. Yes, we're, we're hitting. For a lot not gonna lie to alpha but it's the alpha scorpion armor if you want to get it you got to go to the desert area to spawn the alpha um scorpion bro you have to kill all the um scorpions in the area until you see a massive black scorpion spawn that's the alpha scorpion if you didn't see um if you didn't watch my video on using light magic light magic could damn near solo every boss in the game the only problem it has right now is that it drains mana a lot so you will have to reset um a corrupted alpha scorpion took me 15 minutes to kill corrupted alpha scorpion and we know that takes about like six seven people to kill for like and it takes them like 20 minutes to kill it so you doing it in under 15 15 minutes by yourself is crazy to me you know what i'm saying but yeah brush that heads take care enjoy the build bro and yeah we are using this staff because of you know the poison you know it adds on to the dps so if you do get poison, you know, you're getting that tick damage over time, plus the tick damage from this, plus the tick damage, the crit from there, and the extra damage from there, and then the extra damage from the armor. <sighs> yeah, it's a lot of extra damage. You feel me? And you get fat fire resistance for people that want to use Hell Flame. Yes, Hell Flame's a five leaf move in the game. I'm gonna stop you know, yapping now. It doesn't give me all this information, bro. If you want any more information down below about a broken build you could run, just let me know. Brush your heads, take care, catch on the next video, eek us out.